Super Grover and the Three Bears. One day, Grover went to the school auditorium to see the school play Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Grover didn't understand that a play is just pretend and that an audience is meant to keep quiet. There she is! That is my friend, Prairie Dog! Hello, Prairie! Yoo-hoo! Yo, Prairie! Yeah! Over here! Shh, shh, Grover, really? In the play, Goldilocks ate up all the bear's porridge. And Goldilocks sat on the bear's three chairs. Then she went to lie down on the bear's three beds. Oh, my! This bed is too hard. And this bed is too soft. But this bed is just right. Hmm. As soon as Goldilocks fell asleep, the three bears came home from their walk in the woods. Oh, no, baby bear. There is a little girl sleeping in your bed. Yoo-hoo, little girl. Wake up. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, help. Three big, terrible, ferocious bears. Yeek. Oh, my goodness. My little friend, Prairie Dawn, is in a lot of trouble. Just look at those bears. They must have escaped from the zoo. I had better capture them. This is a job for Super Grover. Oops, sorry. Excuse me. Sit down. Oh, oh, oh dear. I am so embarrassed. I forgot that I must change into my Super Grover costume first. Now, let me think. Ah, yes, I think I saw a telephone booth out in the lobby. Uh, excuse me, please. Hey, that was my foot. Sorry. Well, I never. Sorry, madam. Boy, it sure is a good thing I remembered to put my cute little Super Grover costume into the bottom of my lunchbox. You never can tell when it will come in handy. Ketchup from my meatloaf sandwich seems to have leaked onto my soup for Grover costume. Oh, oh well. Have no fear, Prairie Don! Brave and fearless soup for Grover will take those three ugly and ferocious bears back to the zoo. I do not believe this is happening. Grover, this is a play. Those are not real bears. Do not worry, Prairie Don. I, Super Grover, will take care of these terribly vicious bears so they will never, ever bother you or anybody else again. Grover, it's only a play. Bring them back. I, Super Grover, will teach you big, mean bears not to bother such nice little girls. Look up in the sky. It's an eggplant. It's a meatball. <laughs> There you are, where big, ferocious bears like you belong. And now, back to the auditorium. Adios, bears. Back in the empty auditorium, Prairie Dawn sat all alone on the stage. I will never forget what you did today, Grover. Oh, do not thank me. We superheroes live to serve. Now that those three dangerous bears are back in the zoo, you can go on with your play. Now I'll never be a star. Meanwhile, at the zoo. <laughs> uh -huh. Please hurry, Mr. Zookeeper. Uh -huh, sir. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 